Tesla has quietly unveiled a fleet of new Tesla semi-electric trucks as part of its new financial results report. Still, there's no word on the status of production and customer deliveries. The situation around the Tesla Semi has not been clear for the past few months. In today's video, we'll talk about all the updates of Tesla Semi 2022. But before that, make sure you press that red subscribe button along with that tiny bell icon to get updated every time we post new videos. Let's get started. Tesla CEO Elon Musk previously warned of battery supply limitations and the effect this could have on the Tesla Semi, which was first unveiled as a prototype in November 2017. In January, Musk said the work engineering on the Tesla Semi was complete and deliveries were expected to start this year. He added the warning at the time that the availability of battery cells could limit the company's ability to produce the Semi. The electric truck has already been delayed several times, as it was originally supposed to be delivered in 2019, while Tesla has made progress in bringing its electric semi into low-volume production in Nevada, the automaker confirmed last year that deliveries to customers of the Tesla semi are delayed until 2022. The delay follows the departure of Jerome Guillen, a critical Tesla executive who worked on the development and eventual production of the Tesla semi. Guillen's resignation in June came just three months after he was moving from a job as president of the auto industry, which included overseeing the Tesla Semi, to a position with less responsibilities as head of heavy trucks. Guillen had run Tesla's entire auto business from September 2018 to March of 2021. Some new prototypes have been spotted at the Gigafactory in Nevada in recent months, and PepsiCo's CEO has even said he hopes to get his first Tesla semi-trucks by the end of the year. This has not happened, but the first deliveries could be imminent. Tesla has been granted a patent for a new automatic tire inflation system that allows real-time adjustment of tire pressure on Tesla's upcoming semi-electric truck. It was reported that Tesla filed a patent application for this technology in 2018, shortly after the automaker introduced the Tesla semi-electric truck. While Tesla did not specify whether it will be designed for cars or trucks in the patent application, the inventor listed in the filing, John Furtado, worked on the Tesla Semi program for Tesla. The United States Patent and Trademark Office issued a patent to Tesla dated February 22, 2022 for a Class 8 truck. In the case of the Tesla Semi, fuel isn't much of an issue, but efficiency is still important. Tesla's recent patent reveals that it is working on an automatic tire inflation system, an ATIS, which can overcome one or more causes of underinflation of tires in commercial vehicles. Automatic tire inflation systems can monitor tire inflation pressure through a preset value and reinflate tires whenever the vehicle is below the target level. Although full production of the Tesla Semi has not yet started, some of the company's customers are already actively preparing the all-electric Class 8 truck. In the case of PepsiCo, the food company has already prepared the first mega charger stations for its fleet of Tesla Semi at its Modesto, California site. Tesla, surprisingly, did not comment on the production status of the Tesla Semi in its earnings report today, but did release a new image of a small fleet of four new units. The United States Patent and Trademark Office officially granted Tesla a patent for its version of an ATIS system, but it's important to note that not all the technologies that companies seek to secure with patents end up in commercial products. So that's all for today's video. Let us know your views in the comment section below. And don't forget to like this video before leaving. Thanks for watching.